There have been a lot of nurses, doctors that have been fired for speaking up about the problem of patient safety at their hospitals. That is exactly the opposite culture of what we need. We need to encourage a culture of speaking openly and freely about safety concerns. You know, a lot of people say that their management is increasingly removed from the front lines, that they sense their managers don't really know the problems that the doctors and nurses experience in taking care of patients. That's a dangerous trend in any industry. When you've got your frontline providers telling you that our managers are out of touch with our safety concerns, of course you're going to have a lot of mistakes. Of course there's going to be a lot of overtreatment. Of course the quality is going to be highly variable. I see it in my own practice with patients that are coming for second opinions. They've been told all kinds of crazy things about what they need or shouldn't have done or should have done. You know, medicine by and large is still a discretionary science. About one quarter of everything that's done in healthcare is evidence-based. Another three quarters is purely discretionary. If we're going to really work towards the common mission of delivering care that we think is best for patients, we've got to listen to the doctors that are telling us they don't like the climate, they don't like the pressure to see more patients, do more operations, do increasingly more regulatory work that burdens them every day. We've got to listen to our doctors if we're going to really address the problems in healthcare.